When you connect to Zune through a USB port, not only can you play it through the audio system, but you'll be able to control it using the audio system controls as well. When using your Zune through the USB port, there are some things to keep in mind. 1. Start your IKEA before connecting your Zune. 2. Allow time after connecting a Zune for the Uvo eServices system to recognize it. And 3. Never disconnect a Zune while it is the selected audio source. Connecting a Zune to the USB port should automatically activate Zune mode after the audio files are identified. Keep an eye on the loading icon. When the flashing stops, the Zune will play. Depending on the number of audio files, this can take just seconds or several minutes. If it doesn't load, you'll need to press the media key on the control panel until the Zune indicator appears in the top left corner of the touchscreen. To select a song, press the Seek Track key on the control panel up or down, or press the up or down arrow keys on the steering wheel. You can select a new song manually by turning the tune knob left or right until the desired song appears on the screen, and then press it to play. To select a song from a list of songs, press the menu button then the Now Playing button. Then select the desired song. You can also list songs according to certain criteria. Just press the menu button and you'll see options to list songs by songs, genre, album, artist, or playlist. Press one of these criteria and from the list that appears, select the desired title. To manually play music, select the Play button on the Uvo eServices touchscreen. To pause, select the Pause button. And for more information, always check the Uvo System User's Manual or the Uvo eServices Guide on the Audio Control Unit.